Jillian Oakes, congratulations on the film. Thank, Thank you. you. Now, in uh, Wonderstruck, you get to sort of go wild in the Museum of uh, Natural History. Talk a little bit about filming that. What was that like for you guys? Well, it's really incredible because um, it was also a great honor to be able to film in the Natural History Museum. But um, working in the Natural History Museum, we had to load in and load out every 6 p.m. to... Um, it was like three, three, three o'clock in the morning um, on the weekends so that we could film the scenes that we needed to and it was kind of hard to do that because obviously the museum has to open up during the day so it, it was um, a little rough to move in and move out um, every weekend but we it was had a really lot of interesting fun. And, and very very fun. Did you guys have a, a favorite moment while you were filming? My favorite moment to watch is the scene where, uh, where I get mad at him. Where yeah, where he. Well, that was my favorite scene to shoot. I loved shooting mm -hmm. that scene where he runs out and, uh, it's it's very tense. It's a very tense moment, and you know you have to go into that mentality. You know before, he's such a upbeat kind of guy, Jamie, and even after that scene, he's still very upbeat and happy. So this is that time where you know things get serious for him, and mm -hmm. uh, that's my favorite one to shoot, but my favorite scene to watch is the scene where uh, Oaks first kinds of opens the door into, into New, York New York City, and now you're like, wow, look at New York City in the 70s, you got these people in the polyester clothing, and then that song comes on, and I love that song, like the little bass guitar, and boom, you know, I love that scene. Yeah. Now, Oaks, uh, you have to play, uh, you, you have to play the role, obviously, without language, and without hearing. And talk a little bit about uh, the challenge of, of playing that, uh, that role. Because um, I am a hearing character that then becomes deaf, uh, it is kind of hard for um, the preparation, um, but eventually once you get into the character, it's pretty simple after you kind of get the basics down and uh, you get to really feel it's, it's a weird feeling once you get into it because you almost think you can't hear and you feel like you are maybe even deaf, but then somebody says something and you snap out of it. But for a second, you, you kind of have a different way of thinking and it's, it, you're in a little bit more of a trance. <laughs>